Born in 1892 under the name Rose August Wegner, many know this woman as Helen Gibson. When the lifestyle of the Wild West was put to an end, most cowboys and cowgirls transitioned into stunt work and acting, and respectively, she was one of the first ever professional stunt women in the film world. Gibson got her start as a trick rider in rodeos, getting her first cowgirl job from an ad in Billboard magazine. At the age of 69, Helen Gibson's last role was in a 1961 John Ford movie named The Man Who Shot Liberty Valance, for which she was paid a sum of $35, thereafter retiring in January of 1962 on a motion picture industry pension of $200 a month. 